Development is the building block of creating applications that scale, that are complex, and that function efficiently at the highest levels, which is why we believe in giving developers superpowers. We've heard from hundreds of users who are Flutter developers who have been using Flutterflow to expedite their own workflow, as well as to learn how to develop with Flutter at a higher level. In this video, I wanna share five top features in Flutterflow that have been used by developers to expedite their development workflow. So let's dive right in. Number one, there's absolutely no lock-in with the Flutterflow platform. Flutterflow at its most powerful is best used as a low-code platform. Unlike other platforms, it's fully extensible. The developer menu gives you many options to have control over your code. However, in order to best extend Flutterflow's capabilities, you can create custom widgets, custom functions, and custom actions with our IDE. Here's an example of building a custom widget using our IDE, featuring a Rockstar Flutter developer and our growth engineer, Shovik. To build a custom widget inside Flutterflow, go to the custom code page from the left menu. Click on add and select widget. Now you can start by giving your widget a name. And if your widget requires any Flutter package, you can add it under the perspect dependencies. And don't forget to click on this refresh button to fetch the dependency so that you can take advantage of the formatting features inside our code editor. Next, you have two paths to follow. Either you can define the parameters on the right panel and then generate the boilerplate, which will also include the parameter definitions. Or you can just go ahead and generate the boilerplate code now and start adding the parameters inside the code directly. When you are done building this widget, save it, which will automatically add the different parameters to the right panel. Now you can go ahead and compile your code. And once it's done, you are ready to preview it. Great. Now you can access this custom widget inside your project and add it to any page of your app. And not to mention you get the flexibility to pass the parameters and iterate on it with the help of our visual builder, without having to make any changes in the code for any final adjustments. Over to you, Aman. Thanks, Shovik. The custom code IDE is capable of handling most requirements for extending your application. However, you're not limited by this either. Let's say you have an enterprise client or a project with unique requirements that require you to make changes to the code. Here you have two options as well. The first option is that you can download the code to your computer through the developer menu. Second, you can use our integration with GitHub to easily deploy the latest changes to your repository. We deploy to a separate Flutterflow branch. That way the next time you push from Flutterflow, it will override only the Flutterflow branch. Then you can merge updates into your main branch with any modified code. Now that we know you're never limited by Flutterflow, let's explore why developers are choosing to use it in their workflow instead of coding from scratch. Now, even if you are a top level Flutter developer, Flutterflow can give you the power of rapid development. In traditional development, you may have found yourself struggling to code a UI by adjusting small design parameters across files, spending countless minutes iterating to get it sort of perfect. Developers have been using Flutterflow to iterate quickly on UI by dragging and dropping pixel perfect widgets and making quick adjustments on our properties panel to view changes in real time, saving both time and frustration. And we can even take this a step further, given our sample apps, components, actions, and more that are available within the Flutterflow community and marketplace. Secondly, instead of creating boilerplate code for a UI theme, which you may have yet to figure out, many devs love using Flutterflow's design system to make adjustments at any time during their build. By allowing Flutterflow to take care of the boilerplate of creating a UI, you can focus on the challenges of development that are actually important to you. Now, boilerplate for setting themes is great, but let's move on to feature number three that allows devs to surpass boilerplate and bugs when setting up backend and authorization. As a developer, setting up a scalable database and the authorization through third parties can be a pain. You most likely set up authentication manually through your preferred database, set up user credentials to intake usernames and passwords, then proceed to set up each individual third-party authentication method, such as Google Sign-In and Apple Sign-In, and set up the individual actions to allow users to activate and authenticate themselves in your app while doing your best to avoid bugs. This entire process takes lead devs at least an hour, and if not more. Given Flutterflow's Firebase integration, you can cut this time in half by jumping straight into Firebase setup. Simply add Firebase to Flutterflow.io as one of your users on Firebase, and then assign the account roles for service account user and cloud functions admin. Then go ahead and add the Firebase project ID to Flutterflow in order to connect the database. 
Finally, you can set up the individual authentication methods that you want to use for your application using our action editor, and easily assign authorization providers and what user collections to use when authenticating. Flutterflow also automatically generates a user collection for you, so you can start on the difficult parts of your application build as soon as possible. The next feature that developers like to use is snapshots and version control. While you're developing, if you don't manually commit your code, you can lose track of your progress. Our snapshots and version control system takes care of that for you. You can save versions of your application build to go back to, but even if you don't save, our snapshots are automatically saved versions of your application that you can take a peek at and then even revert back to if you need. Secondly, if you're collaborating, even if you are pushing code to GitHub, you always have a saved version of your own work that is readily available not to mention the comments feature and the ability to work with others on your application at the same time. Our team's features allow designers, developers, and founders to build together, which saves developers the time and effort of adjusting simpler no-code functionalities that designers or founders can help adjust, and instead allows developers to focus on their technical challenges that they're most suited for. Lastly, let's talk about deployment. Generally, devs have to publish their code manually in order to submit to the App Store. Manually, it'll take around 30 to 40 minutes depending on your skill level, and more time configuring authentication from third-party sources. Not to mention the time it'll take to make changes to your app, to have the correct app ID, maintaining the versions for your application, and building the APK and IPA files. Flutterflow simplifies this process by saving configuration time. Whenever you're ready to deploy your application, Instead of having to set up different deployment strategies in order to publish your app on the App Store, Google Play Store, and the web, you can use Flutterflow to manage this process with one-click deployment. Flutterflow takes care of signing your app with the proper certificates required for publishing to the Google Play Store or the Apple App Store. Also, for the Google Play Store, there's no need to create a keystore manually to keep track of your certificate. Flutterflow keeps track of the version and certificate updates that you need to update your application. Although you're still going to have to create developer accounts and set up your Play Store and App Store profiles, we're able to generate the build files, AAB, APK, and IPA, and auto-upload to the internal alpha beta track that the user has designated through our Codematic integration. In order to create future applications faster and more efficiently, we hope that you'll be able to take advantage of the developer superpowers that are hidden inside Flutterflow. These are tools that can help even the brightest developers make their workflow more efficient. Creating experiences for our users is one thing, but we want to focus on the experience of those building the product, the developer experience. That's one way that we begin to build differently. Let us know in the comments if you're a developer and how Flutterflow has helped you on your application development journey. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.